So there's this ledge spot that I've seen people post clips of and I've always wondered where it is because it looks like a really fun spot, really nice ledge. And I seen someone had posted a clip and in the background was a bridge that looked awfully familiar. So I did a little bit of Google Earth recon, found the spot, came here today, checked it out. Pretty cool spot, tucked away off the road, away from the public eye. I brought my broom. I think I have some wax in the car, so yeah. I'm gonna have a nice little solo session today. Sometimes it's good to skate by yourself. I'll talk a bit about that later, but first, I gotta get to sweeping. <laughs> and I came up across this sandwich bag and look what it is, wax. What a spot, what a great spot. I don't get it. I don't get this trick. I don't understand it. But you know what the irony is here? Back in like 2021, I could backsmith. I backsmith down the three hubba, if you will, at El Sereno. Dan filmed it. But I just can't seem to remember how to do it. Like, you're supposed to have your board touch the ledge as you slide or grind across the ledge, but I keep lifting it up. I don't know how to put my foot down without my heel touching the edge of the ledge. I'm out of breath. I fell over, hit my head, and I uh, got a palm scratch. I'm done with this one. One of the main reasons why I enjoy skating alone sometimes is because you have this kind of attention and clarity that you can spend on like concentrating on your own type of skateboarding. I'm not saying that skating with friends is bad or isn't helpful because it definitely is. You guys seen how my capabilities skateboarding are much greater when skating with Dan, but sometimes I feel like I'm kind of pressured to learn something on the spot real quick, you know? So kind of get in my head and the makes that I do land, like the tricks that I do land, I either like Hail Marys, like I'll just Hail Mary one and like try, or like I'll spend like 30, 40 attempts trying to land. So I feel like skating by yourself, you can really concentrate on what you want to learn and if you film yourself skating alone too, you're actually able to see yourself skate and see what your body's doing wrong if you need to correct anything like weight or foot position, stuff like that. That's why I enjoy skating alone sometimes. I'm, as you guys seen, I'm still trying to figure out the backsmith, honestly. Like, I know someone that has a really good backsmith, shouts out Skateboarding Jordan. His backsmiths are like dipped. Like I've seen him backsmith and the nose of the board is like dragging along the ground. That's how I want a backsmith, but my body just won't allow me to. Another great reason why I think skating alone is good is because if you are introverted like myself, believe it or not, I'm pretty introverted. I, I'm an only child, so I'm quite used to doing things by myself. I grew up skating the majority, first part of my life without anyone. Like I'd go and skate by myself at the football field up the road that had like this three set and a couple ledges. I feel like skating alone has always been that kind of foundation for me and you gain this kind of sense of connection with your skateboard as lame and as like Hollywood as that sounds you gain like a better connection with your board I don't know if you guys are going to think that's cringy but I personally believe that I feel like I have more of a connection to my board and I'm able to concentrate and get in like the right mind state to like skate and like learn things when I'm alone so yeah, I don't know if that's cringy or not, but comment below if you kind of feel like you've had that experience where you're, you, you're skating alone on the session, you're getting things done, you're learning things, and you feel this kind of humbling feeling where it's like, okay, I feel like I'm like in the zone with my board. <laughs> 
<laughs> Another great thing too is like I get a lot of people DMing me and commenting saying that they're beginning to like they're beginners and learning to skate and they feel intimidated to go and skate at the park around people and that's completely normal. I feel intimidated sometimes going to skate parks in LA, you know? So skating alone kind of gives you that confidence and backbone because then you know your capabilities when the time comes around to like going to the park when you feel comfortable enough to go to a park and skate with people you kind of already have that sense of foundation of skateboarding so you're not learning on the spot i want to make a video about doing all the tricks that i hate backsmith being one of them i don't hate the backsmith though i just feel like why why isn't my relationship with the backsmith as healthy as it is with the front smith you know front smith i have in the bag like that's a trick i can do pretty much like first go but backsmith is like a completely different ball game so comment below if you guys want to see me do like a series of videos like doing tricks i hate part one another one is the hard flip always sucked at hard flips apart from that there's the backsmith the hard flip and the backside big spin i struggle with greatly so yeah, comment down below if you guys want to see that. Don't go on park. What's the beach, Mission Beach? Got some e bikes. And, uh, yeah, we're gonna do some e bikes. enjoyed the video please leave a thumbs up if you're new here subscribe check out eveningmob.com pick something up free stickers of every order and yeah feel free to drop a comment below to if you think that skating alone is better or worse than skating with friends but it's always a good time to skate with friends so yeah anyway thanks for watching the video cheers if you've made it this far and i'll see you guys in the next one Red, I want you to go to his house blow that joint up don't let nobody out oh get trigger man bring him to me cause i'm tired of this trigger man stuff in tennessee now all the time while this stuff is going on i called up another roadie on my flip phone junior i want you to call down the texas special order me a man to man to do a maxi kick them windows on the junk and we ride the